Judge Trapp has completed his placings in the Milking Shorthorn four-year-old cow class. There were nine animals exhibited in this class. Would our junior exhibitors please take a step forward? The second place junior is entry 2421, North Stars Patton Penny EXP, shown by Michael Peterson and the North Star Syndicate of Ogilvie, Minnesota. Penny was also the production award winner in the class. Her best record at two years, 11 months of age, 287 days, she made 23,986 pounds of milk with 3.2% fat, 758 pounds of fat, 3.1% protein, and 746 pounds of protein. The best, excuse me, the first place junior in the class and third place is entry 2428, GMC Innisfail Princess 610 ET, shown by Brooke Clark of Cornish Flat, New Hampshire. In second is entry 2418, Rovin Alad Belesima ba Bailey, shown by Carla Ruzik Stetzer of Alma Center, Wisconsin. Winning the class, she's the best bread and own and best utter, is 2429. Innisfail Are You Lady 6078 EXP, shown by Katie Bew and John Stewart Rowey of Elma Center, Wisconsin. Congratulations, and now to our judge for his comments. Well, a nice group of four-year-olds out here in our milking shorthorn ring. The cow that uh, we win with, uh, she's had three calves, uh, been fresh since the spring. The second and third cow have been more recently fresh. The first cow just kind of puts it all together today. She's got that advantage of having more spring of rib when you get in behind him, more depth of rib than the cow in second. Also, when you get in behind him, the first cow's just got a big advantage in the rear udder, height and width and extension, fullness and curvature to the rear udder. I also prefer our first cow, her teats are placed a little bit more on the midline of the udder than the cow that's coming out in second. The cow in second over the cow in third for us today, just a little bit, quite a bit nicer in her forewater attachment. She's got that beautiful veination, that forewater's knitted on a little bit nicer than the cow that's coming out in third that's more recently fresh with her fourth calf. Fourth, or excuse me, third over fourth, a third place cow for us. Just a little bit more of an uphill run, a little square in her rump structure. And when you get in behind them, she's got more definition, a seam right up through the back of the rear udder, more width of rear udder, and she's had that advantage of having one more calf than the cow that's coming out in fourth. Then fourth over fifth, the fourth cow is a lot more youthful in her udder attachment, a little bit more balance in her makeup than this ultra dairy cow that's coming out in fifth. Fifth over sixth, the fifth cow is got that clean cut dairy look to her, just not quite as youthful in the udder attachments to move up higher, but she uses her sweep of rear rib and her clean cutness to go over this cow that's coming out in six. Congratulations to our exhibitors.